Hello, um, Islanders fans, and welcome. Well, hello, um, it's me, the Soap Funny Comedian, presenting Soap Reviews in the morning. Yeah, I'm sorry I didn't review. Um, this is my review, obviously, Islanders of Soap soap Reviews. Um, yeah, I'm sorry I didn't review yesterday because I'm tired. It's 11 o'clock at night, sorry. <laughs> yeah, um, Yes, um, yes, this episode was really, really good and brilliant at the same time, well, and fantastic as well. Um, yeah, it was. Um, bit of emotion aside, it was feels, um, yeah, the Mitchell, I'll do the synopsis first, the Mitchell family rallying around Phil as he receives update on his was um condition. Jack tries to build a future for his family but will Ronnie agree with his plans. Patrick takes matters in his own hands. Yes. Um yes, Jack and Ronnie are well Jack takes Ronnie Yeah, Jack takes Ronnie um um to the house where um they're going to live, hopefully, to buy. And to get away from more food because of what happened. Uh, from last week's last week's episodes, where um, there was a stabbing at um, at Denny's, um, Will's, um, Amy's um, school. Yeah, it was um, Jack um, had enough, so he wanted to move away from Walford for good. Yeah. But um, in the other ways, um, Louise um, goes well, um, pretend well, goes to Phil tells Lily um, um, Louise to go to school, um, but um, she doesn't. She goes to the hospital with with um, with Sharon and um, Phil about his condition. And it doesn't go well. No, his condition is worse than ever before. And yeah, they had the results in, and yeah, it's worse than ever before. So, um, you can be still at the transplant list, but it's not going to work. Um, yeah, so, um, I don't think Phil's going to die. I don't want Phil to die, but the Mitchell family is one of my favourite um, families of the of Easterners and the Carters as well. Um, yeah, yeah. Patrick takes matters on his own hands to um, um, t- tell Dot to go to the hospital to check her eyesight, and yeah. It, her eyesight has gone worse. Um, yeah, that has was, was revealed that it, she's going, but well, she's going blind, and yeah, Patrick uh, has to take matters into her own in his own hands because of um, Dot not going to a hospital to check have a check up about her eye eyesight. Um, but yeah, at the end of the episode um, of EastEnders, um, um, Louise, um, Sharon, and Phil, yeah, um, were um, going around, and then Ronnie as well. But Phil had a emotional turn that it that Phil said. Was um, Louise wants Phil to go to her her dad to go to the Ronnie's wedding, talking about the wedding, and but Phil said, oh, "I'm I'm I'm not gonna be there, am I?" And yeah, and he says, "I'm not going. I'm gonna ask the doctors to not um have the transplant." And Sharon's shocked, Ronnie's shocked, and Louise is shocked. Will Sharon, t- will Sharon, will Sharon change his way? Um, 
Will Sharon meet um make film and uh, Phil change his mind? We don't we'll have to find out tonight. Yeah, each sentence continues tonight at half seven. Don't miss them guys. And yeah, and don't miss my um review of this week's um tonight's Hollywoods and he sends as well. And yeah. I hope you enjoyed this review guys. Um I'm gonna give it um a nine point nine point yeah, nine out of ten because it was a good episode and brilliant as well. I really enjoyed it. Um give this a big thumbs up, comment down below what do you think of last night's episode of Eastenders. Hope you enjoyed this guys and see you for more so reviews tonight. And don't go and don't miss um the character reverse chances tonight as well. Hope you enjoyed this um, review guys. See you soon. If you enjoyed this um review guys, click here to subscribe and click here to uh, watch uh, my Hollywood review of so, re reviews. Hope you enjoyed this um, review guys. Yeah, click here to subscribe and click here to um yeah, click here to subscribe for more soap reviews like this and click here yeah, click here to um watch my audience review. Hope you enjoy this review guys and see you soon. Bye.